So I'm back with more Black Ops 2. Now, this map, oh god, slums, yeah, I think so. Uh, this is actually fucking ages ago I recorded this, and that's what I mentioned in one of the other videos where I go to throw a stun, but it won't let me move to the side and throw it, like strafe, so I had to, like, look to the side to walk out. And yes, Greg's there as well, he's in a lot of my games. As I say, this is old, probably about two weeks old, so I can't honestly remember it. I do know I, I do pretty well, and of course the store, scoreboard's at the end of the game as well. And uh, I'm still in love with the MTAR. And in fact, I did a, a 1v1. Oh, hit my mic now. I did a 1v1 against Greg last night. Because uh, he said, if I beat him, I'll get a game. So I chose Santa too. And uh, I ended 20 for 6. So we'll see if he actually pays up on that bet. I don't know. But oh well, I we'll guess we'll find out. Uh, I've seen... I've been on this map quite a lot, but my favourite by far is probably Cargo. It's probably the map that I'm most consistent on doing well with. It was hijacked a while ago. I, I kept posting some Black Ops 2 gameplay on the Xbox, and every map was hijacked. Uh, I don't really do well on that map on PC, though. But I am enjoying PC gaming a lot more, especially now on my, my new computer. I don't know if I could still say it's new, it's probably about a month, one and a half now, but for me it's new and I'm, I'm happy that I can now play a lot of games in Ultra and get more than 60 frames per second. In fact, majority I get 100 frames per second or around that, but I tend to cap it at 60. Uh, unless I'm recording there, I cap it to 30 because when you start recording you sort of lose like 20 frames and then it starts bouncing up and down between the highest and lowest, so it starts like stuttering and getting really jerky so I, I tend to cap at 30 but you'll notice like some things where I am sort of like bad at on PC but I would still feel like there's room for improvement and I am getting better the more and more I play I mean it's not like uh, pros at console were pro from the first moment they picked up the controller so like, you, you're constantly learning which is why I sort of like enjoy computer or not like I mean video gaming in general as opposed to just PC is you're always learning new things like I uh, I never drop shotted until Modern Warfare 2 that was when I first drop shotted uh, I don't know how long it was around to them um, Gears of War it was pop shotting that I had learned with the shotguns you would like pop into aiming and pop out sort of thing so you'd be more accurate and there's like various things like that you're constantly learning new strategies whether it's new ways to run around the map or new ways to uh, get to the enemy or to leave a certain guy or to finish him uh, also like how to use the certain gun like there might be certain ways like the AN-94 it suggested that you feather it so in other words you constantly tap it because the first two or so bullets I think it's first two the first two bullets are the most powerful so you, you sort of like always learn stuff which is why I really do enjoy gaming because uh, I love to learn and I always have been like that and of course I'm still adjusting my kill streaks now, but I tend to only use these kill streaks. Totally segue. And I do get the, the double kill, but I do get the third kill. Sit down. And now I'm back on my B23R. Which I reckon I'll probably stick with the B23R as my backup. It's a really good and consistent gun. And uh, I'm, I would have died there if Greg never came up behind me to kill the other guy. Because what happened there is a... And I, I do this all, I, I'll see two guys, I'll shoot at one, then shoot at the other, then shoot at one, then shoot at the other. When I should just like focus on the one, then turn to the other. But it's because I like mistime the deaths, because I'm sort of like trying to predict when the guys will die. Uh, the other things is I've still got another two games for Black Ops 2, which is, uh, they're old gameplays, but I've not really gotten time and, or gotten round to doing the commentaries for. That shotgun was a fail, and if I paid attention to my map, I would have killed him. He actually killed Greg at the same time, if you could see in the uh, kill feed. Uh, me and Greg were talking about it, and we are going to try to do different gameplays, so it's not just uh, TDM. TDM's what we predominantly play, but we're going to see if we can get some like, hard point, or capture the flag, or dom like, demolition, or domination, like various other game modes, so there's some sort of objective. And it'll be interesting to see how I adjust my gameplay to the objectives as well because you know I've it, one TDM it's just run and gun and get as many kills as you can and I'm really good at getting kills um, I, I'm sort of like I'm amazed at some of the gunfights I can win on PC considering like I don't know if I could have won it on console and I have completely quit Xbox to be a PC gamer now 
So we'll see how that turns out for me. And uh, that's us coming to a close, guys. So hope you're enjoying the call, uh, the, the Black Ops gameplay I'm posting. And there will be more PC jump shot. Goodbye.